Next up, Defiance Division Three action, Ottawa Hills and Lake. Great start for the Green Bears, already up 3-0 in the first. Jay Breed into left field, it drops in. Luke Nepper's going to come home as Ottawa Hills scores four runs in their first inning, but the Flyers chip their way back into it. Drew Pavlik lines one into right. Corbin Adkins will come in to score, and just like that, it is 4-4 in the fourth. Later in the inning, Jay Blazovich off and running, and the throw is off the mark, and he will continue on. That's going to allow Tablick to score. Lake in front, and the Flyers soar to the 8-4 victory, advancing to the regional tournament. Oh, I know our team that they can easily make plays and I trust them behind me when I'm pitching. So when I throw it, I know that if it gets hit, it's going to get caught or ended up getting an out. Last year, it was pretty much the same group of guys. We didn't we weren't very successful the whole year, but now coming out here this year, getting a great start to the season and finishing it right now and keep on going. We're feeling good. Feeling good, Lewis. Looking good, Billy Ray. Kevin Peel and Rick Poland, how do you see it? Well, what a game between Lake and Ottawa Hills. Two teams that are very familiar with each other, having squared off throughout the last several years in important games like this. And for the first time, Lake is able to break through. And really, Ryan Wagner helped steer the ship for this Lake team when things were not looking good early. 4 nothing, Ottawa Hills in front after an inning. But he really settled in and helped this team get back on track. It shows you what a good team Lake is because when a really good team like Ottawa Hills gets ahead of you and you have a history against Ottawa Hills of, of not being able to perform maybe uh, you know up to your best. 18 and 10 finish on the season for Ottawa Hills. Year 44 at the helm of the program for Coach Hardman. What are mm -hmm. going to be your main takeaways from this group? Well, you know, it, it's a, you know a, a very good group, a, a group that had some good senior leadership themselves, but also a group that's kind of young on the infield. They're, they've got some underclassmen. Uh, there, there's a lot returning, and I'm, I'm sure you know. It, Every year is a new year, and the eternal optimist uh, is Chris Hardman, and so uh, he'll 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 regroup with the guys that he's got, uh, you know, coming back next year. And I wouldn't be surprised if we're not right back here again, seeing another district final. They always seem to reload as well as regroup. Ottawa Hills, their season comes to a close, but the Lake Flyers, now 25 and four on the season, make their first regional appearance in 10 years. They play in the early game on Thursday in Hamler against either Winford or NBC foe Oak Harbor.